cure tutorial on how to play audio from a key as you can see I have my profile loaded I have different banks loaded you can hit the F keys to switch between banks you can also use the on-screen display to switch between banks it's really that simple uh, select the key you want to play my signature drop is on the one key so I can hit the key spacebar will stop it I can also hit the on-screen display and this stop will stop it you have uh, different modes here you have simul play mode which allow you to play any number of keys at the same time you can play one two three four million keys at the same time if you don't like that feature click here goes to single play mode you can only play one key at a time when you click the next key it'll stop the first key that's playing um, you also have two modes you have stutter mode and start stop we have one of these players loaded down here which you load and basically play the players the same way they also have keys uh... The corresponding keyboard keys that will play your players only difference between the players and your keys is the players do not save to your profile they're just extra players if you're on start stop mode when you play it'll start to play when you hit the key again instead of stuttering it'll stop so it'll start stop start stop same thing when you hit the on-screen display, start, stop, start, stop. That's how you play audio from a key using Qit. One final note, to export the sound out of your laptop, you have one of two options. The first and most common option is an 8th inch plug out of your internal sound card to an auxiliary in on your mixer. Or you have the option of using an external sound card via the USB, something similar to this. Those are the two ways to export your sound out of the laptop.